I will, Andre. Telling your followers that you've started a live. I'm ready. I'm there. And we're and we're live. We're live. Coming to you live from the Polish Pinky Salon. We are. We are here. We are here. We are here. here. We're here, and we're excited. We are so excited because what does t- today mark the start of? Expo week. Expo week. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> um, I'm ready. Bring it on. It's a week. It's, it's Friday. It's it, gonna be. No, nope. no, it's on Saturday. I have to be there on Friday though. I was gonna say today's Monday, but you're really cute. Um, it is. Yeah, it is Saturday. It's gonna be great. Oh, it's gonna be so fun. I'm yeah. super excited for this year. I feel like. It is. I just know there's a lot of product yeah. going, so I'm like. I want to shop, and I already know what's going. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We can shop every day, but we still want to do it while we're there. We do. Um, It is going to be great. Um, Hi. 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 I'm Rachel. I'm Sheridan. I work in the warehouse. She's the gremlin that never comes out. She does. They let me out. Today. (laughs) It's going to get weird. (laughs) Uh, It's going to get weird. uh, Tammy, no, I did not get HBO Max. I went on Peacock. Don't you worry. Oh, I found my vampire, vampire diaries. diaries. That was a journey. I watched some documentary on like black holes, and I was like, I don't feel like I'm smart enough. For this. Anyway, I love that. She's uh, a documentary girl, though. She is. She is consistent. She is. Um. Like we said, yeah, the expo is this weekend, and so we thought we'd just come on and start showing some uh, must-haves and our favorites. And this is the this is the time to stock up. Um, if you haven't been to the Utah Nail Expo before and it's your first time, congrats! What a time it is. It really is. Um, if you've been before and you're a repeat, uh, can't wait to see ya. What a time it's gonna be! Oh, sweet Caleb. <laughs> The hair that never ends. (laughs) You just find hair everywhere. Um, So we're just going to go over some of our favorites. Um, What do we want to start with? What do you you feel? We got a mess. We got a mess over here. There's a lot here. You want to do like tools first? Sure. I have. You have no tools. I have no tools. Okay, great. Well, I'll start then. Um, I am talking about these pushers. Ooh, yeah. They're just. I feel like I haven't ever found a pusher that I love. I know you guys love the accents one, yeah. but I feel like for me it's too fat. <laughs> I like a no, skinny I, one. Yeah, I have noticed that. So we just got this new Stolix one. It's the Smart 56. So it's just got a little bit of a smaller end, but it's still sharpened on this end. Mm-hmm. And then you still have your chisel on this end too. I don't really know. Like a makeup artist. I don't really know how to do that. <laughs> But I really love this one just for like your everyday pushing. Yeah, <laughs> just your average Joe just your and average their Joe's. average size nails. Yeah, that don't have like anything crazy. But I love really that. love this guy, which is the orange wood stick. So it's basically the same end as an orange wood stick, but it's like sharpened. And like those, what are those? The tight cuticles that are stuck to the nail plate Mm, this like goes right under it and just scoots her right up i have a client that has like have you used this no oh you got it i have a client that has like great walls of china and so getting under that 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 wall and pushing it back this is a bomb i feel like this is a must have okay well looks like i know what i'm using on sarah tomorrow because i'm doing sarah's nails oh yeah she has the worst cuticles yeah you should try the planet Cause it just like scrapes really good. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, oh, great. Mm-hmm. These two. Yeah. Must have. Love those. Get them. Excellent. Um, I forgot to grab mine. Uh, I was gonna talk about my favorite nippers as of late. Oh, uh, yeah. Just the, just the. We love our stallets nippers. Yeah. Um, but I think it's the, with the, the H hinge, not the spring. Oh, the that's the smart tens. Have that. Mm-hmm. Sure. And the 30 and the 31 have mm-hmm. the spring. Yeah. Yeah. The tens um and the like the four is my favorite size. I love the four millimeters. Those I ones like are just like the perfect. Yeah. yeah. 
I just love them. Um, I was gonna grab them, but they're in the farm side currently. So, oops, they gotta wait. Um, we'll just move on to some other tools then, uh, which are the nail art tools that we know and love. Um, if you didn't know, Ugly Duckling has some pretty incredible nail art brushes and tools. Um, and we, I don't know, we just, you just find what you love and you stick with it. And one of my favorites is the Painter. This one has been such a cool addition to my collection. I love it. It's like a, it's like a thick, dense striper. So this one is awesome for doing um, any kinds of nail art where you need a lot of space filled in. Like if you're doing like a really, like if your client has really long nails and you're doing a French, you're not gonna do that with a detailer brush. You're gonna lose your mind. Um, but if you're using like a gel paint and you don't have like that bottle brush, this one is amazing to use. And I love the way that this, I don't know, I just love the bristles. Like they're so soft, but they're just, I don't know, they're just very pliable and they do what you want. Uh, and then my uh, Omni tool, which is just a, just your standard double-headed dotting tool, but it's fancy because it's got crystals in it. I also feel like it's a little bit tinier too, like yeah. this end is yes. I love the I love the like basically pin yeah. head needle head, and then you got your average medium medium dot on the other one, and I just love that. I just love a good Omni tool. But I, if you haven't played around with the Ugly Duckling brushes, you really should because they're so nice. They're amazing quality. They really are, and like the price point too. Like oh yeah, it's a beaut. And this really is. this is the gel brush six minus. I should have grabbed mine. Don't look at it. Don't Mine's look at brand it. new. Don't look at it. But this comes in silver, white, and black. Mm -hmm. So, like, you can have one for your gel and your glitter gel and whatever. Mm -hmm. I love that. One for colors. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, I also really love the striper. Yes. The striper, the striper is just, like, the perfect. And then the detailer. The, it's like it was literally yeah. micro it is a micro detailer brush and it is so cool it's so cool yeah. if you're doing like really detailed nail art mm -hmm. to have that like <laughs> just, a, just like a baby just, yeah. i just, love those two brushes this is tiny uh nails by nicole j collection hello hi hi, hi. Hey, thanks hi. for joining um all right staying with the ugly duckling train we're i'm just gonna move on to um some some must-haves um we've Stop. got our this is just the the best trio in all the land uh prep primer and builder base if yeah. you haven't played with these you really should this is an incredible like oh my gosh how do you even describe builder base it's the most beautiful yeah. like juicy rubber base it has it's good adhesion. so it's so nice levels like a dream. Like a dream. I love it's it. It's just beautiful. It's on mine too. Yeah. My favorites. Clearly, you can't live without it. No. And then along with that, you need the prep and the prime because I, this is just an incredible duo to pair with those. Um, but it is nice that they came out with, um, I don't have the foo-foo one over there. Um, yeah, thank you. Uh, they came out with three base colors to go with the Builder Base collection. So there's um, just a regular pink, there's a fairy, or just a fufu, not a fairy fufu, uh, just a fufu pink, and then a milk, milky white. So the fufu, if you don't know, it's just like a, like a nude, like a nude pink. And it's more of that like opaque rather than like a semi sheer. It does have some, some pigment in it. It's got some uh, opacity. And then this is the pink. This one I love. It's just a beautiful semi sheer light pink. I just love it. I love the more pink tinted bases. I feel like I gravitate towards those. And that one is just beautiful. And then the Milky White. This is stunning. Um, this was like a big trend for a second. The like milk milk bath nails or just any of those like milky white um i don't know milky white faces with whatever thrown in so that one is a is just great because then you kind of cut out some steps you don't need as much product on if you're doing anything with the tinted bases and it also makes your life easier when you're using colors that tend to be a little bit more patchy like neons or pastels 
Um, throwing a tinted base under there really helps. And it makes them pop too. It really does. Put a neon over a over like the white yeah. mm. or even the pink too. It yeah. just gives a little more Yeah, just a little more coverage. Yep. So we love that. Um and then yeah, we got our good old buddy the just the tried and true incredible <laughs> ugly duckling matte top coat. Yep. Which get it if you haven't. Why haven't you? It's incredible and it oh, is yes. the most incredible matte top coat you will ever use. I will say, give it a stir, give it yeah. a shake before you use it, because like I forgot that that's too. a thing. <laughs> forgot that that's a thing, and I was like, why is it shiny? No, it, you need to stir it up, yep. and it will just... It's but beautiful. it, like, stays matte, too, and even some of these, like, I'm hard on my nails, yeah. it stays matte, even when you're a, a worker. It's true. It's true. It's true. Uh, staying on Ugly Duckling, I have this color, I don't know... It, it matches my ring. It's just blue. It's number seven. It's, it's just blue, but it's so cute. I've had my eye on it, and I'm like, I need it on my nails all the time. But this oh, is a color. That's swatched. a you color. Mm -hmm. Like it, it really does. It's a. It's a. All right, it's, it's, it's your me. lapis. It is. Yeah, I just, I gravitate towards blue, and this just has such cute pigment and like. It really does. It's a little it's just, bit brighter than it's showing up on camera. Yeah, and it's almost like almost a little bit semi sheer yeah so you kind of get that jelly effect like i love lookout but i love this one almost a little bit more luxio lookout is mm -hmm. what i'm talking mm -hmm. about but i love that one and then i really have been loving the new fall collection you know, the swatches. Yeah. and these aren't even my colors let me tell you i am not She's this is not, not my palette She's this is not that blue is my palette but i used these the other day and i used them with a floral and they are just so pretty. Like these kind of sagey greens. They're, they're very, I think maybe they'll come out already. Yeah, should be over here somewhere, maybe I don't know. Oh. But these are very pretty. And then the mauves. Ooh, yeah, the mauves are so good. Yeah, and this color just makes me think of Rachel. Every time I see, like, I saw a pumpkin this weekend at Joanne's and I was like, like her shirt. She's wearing She's it, so and my whole house is that color. Yeah. See, they're these just three fun. colors. That's what my house looks like. Yeah, but these colors are beautiful. And then this is the was this one out yet? Yeah, it is. It just oh. released. 200. This is this is two hundred. This just kind of completes up to two hundred. Uh, it's just a beautiful pumpkiny orange. Thank you. Um, doesn't have a lot of that like brown in it mm -hmm. like this one does. Um, but these are just stunning mm. colors. They're really pretty for like fall nail art. That's what I use them for. Oh, but like, yeah, yeah, yeah. like a stripe with that's these. Really yeah. Again, yeah. I'm not even that. That's not my color palette. This is Rachel's color palette. Yeah. I really do love them. The pigmentation is so stunning. It's so yeah, pretty. perfect. If you haven't played with Ugly Duckling colors before, this was a great time to yeah. uh, play around with some, yeah. grab a couple for fall, try them out, see if you love them because they're beautifully yeah. pigmented. They really are. And they're so fun to play with. Yep. Um, speaking of fun to play with, we got some cat eyes up in here because we're on the movement. We really, Let's make it happen. we're trying so hard to make it come back because we love it so much. We really do. Ugh. And like all of these are so beautiful. Every single one of these, she does. Oh, actually, this, don't look at this one. Did I put this one on you? One seventy-eight. Is that the color? Looks close. Yeah, but that was like this is one seventy-eight. I did her just the one hand, and it's a little trashed because she's a warehouse gremlin. But uh, this is one seventy-eight, and it is just the most beautiful. Like it's got pink, it's got purple, blue, pink, green. That's just so stunning. But the the cat eye effect in all of these is so strong when you get your magnet out. It's so cool. Yeah, I just they freaking work love these. like a dream too. Yeah. So what does it start with? What number it is? I got 170. 170. I think it's 176. 170. Maybe not. 177 through like 185. There's 177. And they're so. Oh, look at that! Like this one for fall. Mm, look at this one. That's just a little more green to it. I feel like these are. They look like a like a scarab beetle. Oh yeah. Mm, and that's just Beatles. A, I want to do bug nails. Be Beatles. <laughs> you do yours. I love the this bug one. Nails. I it's I just did, like a good neutral. Yeah, but it's just so fun. I want to use this. I did <laughs> trout nails on a oh, yeah. and they went on like a whole journey. 
but I think this would be so fun for like that kind of trout effect if you ever need to do trout nails if you have to call yes. somebody go into Alaska <laughs> yeah that's what she was doing I but. did trout nails once yeah, yeah, see? Yeah. It's just so It'd fun. fun. Like, They're so cool. And just fun to add like some dimension in your design. Or yeah, like like a background for your Halloween nail art. Yeah. Like, yeah. A, like a dragon. A dragon? A dragon scales. <laughs> dragon tails. Oh, Aww, oh, cute. Gosh, <laughs> But there's so many different colors of these. They're so fun to play around with. So if you haven't played around with the cat eyes, we're going to have all of them swatched so you'll be able to see what they actually look like in person. And they're so fun. Super fun. All right. Ooh, okay, you got that guy. I, yeah, I really love this color. Yeah, that one's this fun. This is more my palette. Okay, last Ugly Duckling. But this is just color pot number 55. Mm. I should have stirred it. But it... Oh, 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 oh. It's, it's just like glittery, glittery got the swatch goodness, one. and it has so much pigmentation in it that it, like one coat, I feel like for witch nails, Christmas, Christmas like yeah, it's, oh yeah, yeah. it's yeah. yeah, it has it's a lot so in it. There's pretty. like blue and there's green and there's it's kind of like kind of bronzy. Shifty. It's shifty, chameleon effect, yeah. if you will. We it's just very. But all of these fun. color pots are really pretty. There's some pretty colors. There's many colors. Yeah. Like yeah. these glitters. Yeah. These glitters Love are so pretty. Ooh, ooh. And we can't miss this guy. Ooh, Who is this? 35? Yeah, 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 yeah. We've talked about this before, but it's just the most beautiful. It's like purple. It's bronzy. It's deep. It's moody. Again, it's kind of shifty. It's shifty. We I love like a good shifty <laughs> duochrome moment. Yep. We all like a shift. <laughs> all right, shifting into Luxio accents. You got? I got a lot. Um, I got just our standard base coats, but I just, I just love all of the base coats. I love, you know, the X Bond and Luxio build um, combination, but I also love Luxio base so, so much. It is just the most beautiful, juicy base. And if you haven't played with Luxio Build, it is just a beautiful, it's not like a rubber base, but it's just like your structure and it is beautiful to work with. It, oh my gosh, the way it self levels, it heals itself so beautifully. And it is just a dream to work with. And then X Bond is just that like, you scrub it in and it has the most excellent adhesion. Um, and then pair it with your Luxio build. Match made in heaven. So I love those. Those ones I would definitely stock up on yeah. at the show. Um, I feel like all base and top coats. Just, like, just grab put them. two or three in your basket. Yeah. Yeah. Stock up. Yeah. Um, and then we've got, of course, the most amazing top coats. We've got Luxio Gloss, which is just a beautiful shiny top coat. This one does have an inhibition layer. Um, but it has incredible shine. Um, I like to use this one over a lot of like the more textured like gel plays. Like if you're using any of the like chunky glittery gel plays, I like to double top coat. Um, and so I usually will do a layer of this first because it's a little bit more juicy, fills in those cracks, and then go over with Shine On. Shine On is the most insanely beautiful, shiny top coat you will ever use in your life. Um, and it does have like UV inhibitors. It has um, has like a purple tint to it. So like when you get a brand new bottle, you'd be like, oh, this is purple top coat. But it's kind of like just using purple shampoo when you have blonde hair. It just keeps those colors fresh, um, especially when you're using whites or pastels. Um, it just helps so that those colors don't fade. Yeah, and I like, like I just did nail art. It just makes your nail art too yeah. if you want like if you're an artist and you want that pop shine on it's beautiful it's so good it's so good uh the nail practitioner will we have a lot of stock at trinity yes we i have a lot it's a lot coming. yeah and we've got all the colors as well yep. not just the clear but we've got colors yep. if you want to see those yep so that it's a great time to stock up on trinity because it has a higher price point, so get a discount on it, stock up. Yeah. yeah. Or even just, yeah, you'll get to see all of the colors. Because sometimes it's hard to see, especially with, um, like, sheer 
semi-sheer bases or um, builder gels and stuff like that, you kind of are like, yeah, okay, but what color is this really? Um, you get to see all of those because we have everybody swatched. So you can take home whatever you want and it's just so nice. Yeah, we've swatched a lot. I feel like every, I mean, I've only been here every one day. year, but we've swatched every year, but mm -hmm. this time they're on the turnstiles. So oh, it's gonna so be excited. so nice. For, I just want to see it like, all the ideas Completely. that we've like, come up with for this expo to come to fruition. To, yeah, that's the way. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I had shine on too. Yeah, yeah. Uh, well, what else you got, I got. Ooh, yeah. The luminous six collection. Yeah. Is this the gilded collection? Just the one. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> this. These are fun. They're, they're just, so fun. They're so pretty. So this is lucid, and it's just. I kind of feel like it's kind of flashy. It is. It's like I feel like all of these are like poor man's yeah. flash glitter. Like instead of mixing up a. A glitter just slap this bad boy on I wish it was coming it doesn't have that like no. super reflective like a flash glitter would but they but, look yeah. the same so like they they're so stunning they are this one's like a gunmetal yeah. silver this, this one's like, like a champagne. champagne this is pigment I love this one and I then, feel like oh I like God. this kind of gold I do too champagne. like the more soft white yeah. gold and then this is chance and this oh, is just okay. like that okay. light pink so rosy pretty. oh yeah. they're so pretty and they're yeah. like an ultra fine yeah. glitter so and these they are apply too yeah like they're fine yeah they're yeah. so nice um and these are really fun to pair like to mix with if you have loose glitters i usually will mix them with this as like this is my glitter base and i'm gonna mix oh, a little something chunkier in idea. it to give it a little more depth yeah, or even like a base and then do yeah it. Yeah, or even like add it on top of a gel play if it's a glitter and it's not full coverage and you want a little more oomph. Add, right. a, add a little bit of one of these yeah. on there. Love it. Love them. Love it. Okay, and then I have, because I just did nail art, I use the line -its for small details. And man. This is incredible. I love them. As incredible. like a outside artist, having something like this, which is an acrylic fill, my loves. Yeah. I, I, they're I so them. beautiful to work with. Yep. The pigmentation in these, I will say, is insane. It um, is. The linets, you do have to be a little bit more careful um, or else you will get like curing issues because they are so incredibly pigmented, um, especially the black. Like yes. you'll get like little pits and wrinkles if you don't do it thin enough. So I will say less is more Absolutely. when it comes to the linets, but these are so beautiful and you can see like they don't move they've got pits in it from where we use it all the time they don't move um they don't run she said they're like an acrylic paint consistency so if you like that more of a thick consistency rather than like more of a self-leveling art gel that is your i was your best friends one of these and i was like those are so that? cute i cure it but you, it doesn't even matter. No, they don't move. I, it didn't move. And then I was like, all right, so I'll just, Might as well just I'll go just cure again. Yeah. But along with the line, it's glistening oh. gold is my favorite gel play. I, so if beautiful. anybody asks me what gel play I feel like is a must have, this is it. Yeah. It's just, it's the same consistent, consistency as like that acrylic base. So again, it doesn't move. And it's just so pretty. I have a client and we call it Tisha Gold because she uses it all the time so it's just it's perfect for fall like those i feel like the chrome look is kind of going around so to do like a chrome flower or something love it a lot easier love than actually pulling out chrome too it's true um yeah and i will say there are some beautiful colors in the just all of the gel play art gels um, and the linets, so these are all of the linet colors. I don't have aluminum, I don't know why, but I don't have an aluminum, but it's just that silvery, silvery to go with these metallics. Um, these ones are so fun to use. Um, I have been using the, like the rose and the bronze lately because it's fall, it's fall, it's fall. And they're so, so beautiful. So those are so fun. And then there's just, you just got some, my dream. Some I love, we love a rainbow, we love a rainbow <laughs> moment. Uh, but these are so nice to use. They're so fun to play with. But there's, like, you can't go wrong. Gel play has so many, I was gonna talk about so that. many things. <laughs> these are the so many. Jill? Yes. So this is gel play. 
That's a dazzle. dazzle. Galaxy, Galaxy dazzle. dazzle. Oh, it's so stunning. And this one has square glitters yeah. instead of like hex, if, if that makes your heart as happy as mine. Like, it's just so fun. It's beautiful. I that with my hand. <laughs> You're doing great. Um, but then the... There is one more of those. Somewhere. That's a Nova. These? Yeah, the These celestial letters. They're so stunning. Um, so the first round was gamma, lunar, and solar, and they're more of that like semi sheer, a lot of iridescent. And then the next round was uh, nova, nebula, and astra. This guy, and they're this one, that gold one. <laughs> And they're just like, they're beautiful. They're more metallic. They have a little bit of holographic in them. They're very dimensional. These ones are so fun to play with. I will say, I think Lunar is one of my favorites that they've ever come out with, yeah. ever. Like I've gone through an entire pot and that never happens with gel play. Like I use it a ton. It is so beautiful. Yeah. It just has like, I've done a lot of like glitter phase with them. And it's so easy just to just swipe it down. If you have a, yeah client needs to get in and out of the door. It's a perfect little yeah. village of something, but yeah. not plain nails. Yeah, no, they're so beautiful. I feel like that's how all the gel plays are, even like yeah. this. Like is these a... glitters, they just apply yeah. so beautifully. Oh, yeah. oh, I gotta talk about oh, yeah, 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 these guys, yeah, yeah, yeah. the, you do. the oh, leaves, okay. because these do apply like butter, yeah. not best. That's the dazzle, but there's more than this. Our swatches got uh, mixed up, so they're a little out of order, but that's okay. But they just apply like butter, and they are so easy to use, and you can use them for nail art. They're a little bit more of a chunky leaf, so if you're trying to get those fine lines, you do have to be a little bit more. Uh, you gotta commit to it. You gotta you gotta move everybody around and maneuver the glitter. But these are so so cool to add into your nail art or to just do full nail up. Um, I will say I love the rose gold and the pewter for fall. Like they're so pretty and like moody. I love those. I love them. Yep. But like oh with with, with ooh, beguiling. beguiling. Wow. Can we talk about beguiling. Wow. Yeah, let's, let's talk about beguiling. Let's, Wow, yeah. she's having a moment. She is. This is my first time ever wearing like a deep red. I, I never, I never wear fall colors, even though I love fall. I'm always like pastels or nude or black. Yeah, but that's like a dark. This is like the vampy red of my dreams. It just look how pretty it is with your skin tone. <laughs> oh, she's a prince. She's a Leo. <laughs> it's just so so good. So Which good. Leads us into the Luxios. Yeah. Because yeah, there are obvious. so so many. Um, like there's there's literally no way we can go through in a day and talk about all the things that you need because that would just be an insane amount of time. There's so many. There's so many. But they're so, so incredibly beautiful to work with. Beautifully pigmented. Uh, this is the new collection. If you haven't played with this already, this is the Dolce Vita collection. And this has been so good in the salon. Like, oh my gosh, can you just this, take a minute? This is like chocolate. Again, not a brown girl. Beautiful. It's so good. And Dolce, this light one. This one is beautiful on every single skin tone. It is. And so are these two, Bravado and Cypress. Yep. Incredible. Yep. Incredible. And I'm very excited for when it's like Christmas reds yeah. come back around because I think Rosso is going to be beautiful for that. And this one for, uh, oh yeah, like trees. winter. Like a snow break on that. Yeah. yeah. But these are beautiful. Yeah, with, what's that one? Lunar. Oh. Wow. Wow. I'll tell you what. Wow. Wow. Uh, yeah, so Luxios are just beautiful, and we love them, and we know you love them, and so we have so many. So many. So many to There's choose just, from. I mean, what do you want? What do you want? We got it all. We got it all. Uh, and they're so nice. It's just a 30-second cure in an LED, two minutes in a UV, and they're just beautiful. The pigmentation in all of these is unmatched. It's they're true. just luxury. I just love Luxio luxury. Section. That's just you. Just hold on to that for a while. That's her favorite. <laughs> I love. I'm a bright girl. All she year. Is, she so is. Bring it on. You know what I'm excited for? What are you excited for? Nat Decker. Nat Decker is our. Nat Decker from Abu Dhabi. 
all the way from Dog 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 Dog. She comes all the way. Oh, my way. mom was like, is that Matt Decker coming? I was like, yeah. <laughs> in that voice, too. Yeah. But we have the sense educators. Yeah. So, you wanna? Mm hmm. Can we talk about her? Can we talk about how incredible she is? And she I has, want to take her class. I, oh, yeah. Yeah, she has class coming up in October. She does. She does actually she wanted to know. I would love to learn from her because she has so much knowledge. Mm -hmm. She's yeah. taken so many classes. Yeah. And I feel the same way about Nat. Like, I just yeah, want to talk to both of them and pick their brains a little. Yeah, like, how do you do whatever? I'm how do you do the things that you're doing? Yeah. 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 Anyway. yeah. 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 So there's going to be so much. Uh, there's. There's just it's gonna so be much. incredible. It's uh, I'm having a brain fart and I'm so sorry. It's a Monday, uh, but there's just gonna be a lot of education opportunities as far as like getting questions answered from educators there because we will have so many educators there to help. Um, if you are wanting to get some like on the spot troubleshooting issues, that's the perfect time to do it. If you want to just come say hi and hang out, that's also a great time to do it because we'll be there. Um, Sarah and I will be there at the Polish Pinkies bits and tools, all that's of that. A fun Ooh, that's a Speaking fun of, I forgot we had this literally sitting right in front of my face. We will have Zephyros. These have been um, kind of a hot commodity. They've been stuck on a barge. Yeah. And we have some now. We do. So if you were and waiting, filters. and the filters, we have so many filters. If you've been waiting for a Zephyros, the expo will be your time to get it because there's a discount. So you're gonna want it at the show. You're gonna want it. You're gonna want it. You're gonna want it all. Yeah, but get I feel like it's basket. just a great time. Yeah, we've got big baskets. You're gonna want to grab one of those. Yeah. Uh, it's just gonna be a great time, and we hope to see you all there. Uh, but if you're not there, we will miss you and love you and hope that you're there in spirit. Um, yeah, just come next year. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there's a great opportunity. Um, but if you can't make it and you still want to shop any of these products, um, they are available at polishpinkiespro.com or on the Polish Pinkies app, available on all the app stores. Um, and sign up for the emails so you don't miss out on anything. Sign up for the texts. The texts text are, are fun. fun. Yeah, there's so much stuff that you get, and, like exclusive access to or um, just like little daily, not daily, but like whenever it comes through, it's just like a daily little like, hey, you're doing great. Here's yeah. the thing, you know? Yeah, I feel like it's nice to have like a little reminder <laughs> from somebody who like is a cheerleader for you, yeah. which is Sarah. Which is Sarah. She will cheer. And our whole team. Yes. Like, we're just here to yes, cheer you on. Yeah. We're all doing great. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Okay. All right. I'm going back to the that warehouse. That sums it up. She's going back to the warehouse. We're going back to work. <laughs> just a minute. <laughs> And I hope you all have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for joining us. Bye. And we'll see you next time.